sex acts on students, all in exchange for A's. A court hearing just wrapped up on the case. Thanks for staying with NBC Charlotte News at 5, everybody. I'm Sarah French. And I'm Fred Shropshire. 28-year-old Juan Vazquez was a teacher at South Mecklenburg High School. Tonight, he is facing multiple sex charges. NBC Charlotte's Tanya Mendez was in court, so Tanya, some very disturbing details came out of that hearing today. Yeah, we learned today that a student actually came forward to report this after he claims that his teacher made lewd comments to him and actually propositioned him. Some of the details in this case are so graphic, though, that we're not going to say them on television. Just a few days ago, South Mech High English teacher Juan Vasquez posing at prom, having fun with his students. But police say Vasquez took that fun across an illegal line. I was shook. I was flabbergasted. That's what I used. Students at South Mech stunned. Their teacher is behind bars, accused of engaging in sex acts with his students. According to the assistant district attorney, Vasquez hosted study groups at his apartment since January, inviting seven teens over to his place. But a whole lot more than schoolwork went down. Police say Vasquez showed pornography to four of the teens even made the students sit in just their underwear. Well, he's a good guy. I mean, like, I don't believe any of the stuff that's happening, like, right now. But police say that's just the beginning of what happened. Police say Vasquez performed sex acts on two of the teens and took explicit pictures of one of them. They claim the teacher promised A's in class if he got what he wanted outside of class. I just hope none of this is, like, true. He's a, he's a really good teacher. He's a really good teacher, man. Like, really. Vasquez has been a teacher at South Mac for three years now and just got his master's. Students say they look up to him, or they did. I just really hope they find out like really what's going on because, like, it's just, like there's someone like life. It's like, it's like someone's career. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's someone's personal image. So supposedly after Vasquez was told not to have any contact with any of these students involved, he allegedly sent a Snapchat message to one of them saying, do me right, implying he didn't want the truth to come out. The judge ordered that he's being held on a $165,000 bond. Reporting live, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte. They are allegations, disgusting allegations though. Thank you, Tanya. Developing right now, a mother killed her 10-year-old daughter fighting for her